le pido a Dios que la guerra no me sea indiferente. Es un monstruo grande y pisa fuerte con la pobre inocencia de la gente. of the jungle, in Santa Marta, in Guerrero, in La Pampa, because, because it seems that every revolution turns to dust, but there is labor in every single one of the protests that led to a revolution. Emotional labor, poetical labor, manual labor, aesthetic labor, magical labor, oceanic labor. Si se calla el cantor, muere de espanto. Si se calla el cantor, calla la vida. Porque la vida, la vida misma es todo un canto. Si se calla el cantor, muere de espanto. La esperanza. La luz y la alegría. Van. Wann bin ich alt geworden? War es ein einzelner Tag? Eine bestimmte Stunde? Eine besondere Woche? Wann bin ich so einsam geworden? Sie schmerzt diese Einsamkeit. Sie sitzt in Schlüsselbein in der Hüfte, im Kopf, im Bauch, sie schmerzt. Ich fordere einen Pakt gegen die Einsamkeit der alten, armen, kranken Frauen in Wien. Schon so lange keine Umarmung mehr. Ich wünsche mir so sehr eine Wortumarmung von euch.
in a way bridge the gap between the art world and sort of what is often, a, in a very general sense, the working class world. Just to take seriously the forms and ideas that like working class people, particularly people who experience gender marginalization, so women and people like me who are assigned female at birth and have particular experiences as being working class people that are still sort of separated from general working class knowledge and to bring both of those complications together in a welcoming way, in a way that says we have something to say and it's beautiful and we would like to share this with you. And it's about the way when the caretakers from Slovakia come to Austria to the destination where they will work for two weeks. And we chose it for the exhibition because it's this counter action, like using something that is really traditional for uh, recuperating some tradition to use it like a critically a way to fight back. Yeah. So when we leave the space, we again see the artwork of the postpartum depression by Milena Gajic. This artwork is uh, dealing with lactation and male lactation, female lactation. And here in the artwork, you see a male that is able to lactate.
mouth and then go so I see something and when you acknowledge it you go it goes it's not a full stop it's a semicolon it says I'm listening I acknowledge you I'm following your story long into the night lights off Laying side by side. Mm -hmm. Kinsugi beschreibt die Kunst, zerbrochenes Porzellan und Keramik mit einer bestimmten Kittmasse und Goldstaub zu reparieren. In Japan sieht man diese wieder zusammengesetzten Bruchstücke sogar schöner und wertvoller an als das Original. Mm -hmm. Wäre es nicht toll, wenn wir Menschen uns genauso betrachten könnten? Jeder Riss, jedes gebrochene Herz und all die kleinen Splitter machen uns noch wertvoller, einzigartig und ganz. The identity of belonging always shifting, the third eye searching for peace building. Belonging to the peaks of the mountains and the roots of the trees, my inner goddess, a woman of color, exhale, prana. Bin jeje im Hof hört man ihn mit forderndem Husten, seinem Schleim lösen, den er hochzieht und dann, als seine Lippen sich zu einer Pistolenmündung formen, in den Erdbereich schlanzt. Mein Vater erzählt selten aus seiner Kindheit in Vietnam. Die Schale der Pomelo packen sie dann in den Kühlschrank, damit er nicht stinkt. Aber so wirklich nach Pomelo duftet der Kühlschrank nicht. <lacht> I realize I hear sounds as I write this. Someone speaks softly. The tea is being steeped. Pages are being turned. I am in this moment, but I am also anticipating its end when others will speak and this moment will evaporate. This moment is still about me. <laughs> but the loudest one are you, or where you, yourself. This is the first time you are screaming and hearing voices and seeing the light. You are prominently announcing your coming. You are here, alive, right now. You are your own entrance bell. Be loud. <laughs>
I produce, I produce, I produce. من تولید می کنم. من تولید می کنم. Also wir nennen das Weizenfeld Annuale, ja, also jedes Jahr, nicht, nicht Biennale, sondern Annuale, äh, jedes Jahr ähm, Weizen äh, zu kultivieren in diesem ähm, 10 x 10 Meter Feld und uns halt äh, künstlerisch und, und kulturell und sozial und politisch und äh, ökologisch äh, mit, mit dem auseinanderzusetzen. Und äh, quasi wirklich mit diesem Stück Land äh, und mit den Pflanzen und all den anderen äh, Lebewesen, die daneben, dazwischen, äh, drunter ähm, existieren äh, zur Arbeit. The idea how to talk about other beings or no human beings, but also what is happening uh, with the agriculture, uh, because not all agriculture is good for the soil, for the land, and especially with corporations and monocultures today. The message of this project is how we are uh, creating relationships with the nature and also how we are thinking about sustainability and what we want uh, to do in this moment where uh, the, corporation, the, the corporations they are um, closing the doors for people they can eat around the world. The way with agricultural corporation is they are buying a lot of Uh, territories and lands in the South America and in the global South. We talk how to care the land, but the real question here is um, who has the property of land? No, he can do it, it because not all people they can harvest or he can have a garden in, in her or his house. No? And we have a lot of arable surface. We could, of course, we could feed ourselves, but it's a strategic decision from the international market to force us to produce things that are just competitive for the market and not for ourselves. And yeah, I think that this, this is why we choose wheat, because it's such a strong symbol of power and how we are powerless, you know, in comparison with these powers. And the worst thing is that it's not, it's not gonna get any better because now China, India and the United States, they decide to ban their exports because they are very afraid that they are not be producing enough wheat for feed their own population. So there is even less wheat available in the market and poorest countries are not able to produce whatsoever. So I think that the situation cannot get worse and worse. And even if it's a very small wheat field, I think that it's a very strong symbol of power, like we can do it. Nordbahnhalle. Wir denken an dich. Sophienseele, wir vermissen euch. Südbahnhof, wir vergessen dich nie. Alle selbstgebauten Spielplätze und Häuschen, die nicht mehr sind, wir sind traurig und denken an euch. Alle Protestbauten, Pyramide Hausfeldstraße, Protestcamp hier Stettnerstraße, 
Wir sind traurig und denken an euch. Die Terrassen am Meiselmarkt, Spielplatz für Kinder und Jugendliche, ein Freiraum. Zuerst versperrt, dann umgewidmet, dann verbaut. Wen kümmert's? Venediger Au, wir brauchen dich. Alle Baumhäuser, die nicht mehr sind, wir sind traurig und denken an euch. Kleines, Kleines großer Gasthaus in der Ungargasse. Wir hätten gerne noch einmal Knödel bei dir gegessen. Parkplatz St. Marx, wir brauchen dich. Kommt die Stadthalle, wir brauchen dich nicht. Wir wollen offene Plätze, offene Räume, offene Straßen. Alle Bewohnerinnen aus allen abgerissenen Häusern, alle Bewohnerinnen, die sich alle Dachgeschosswohnungen nicht leisten können, alle Bewohnerinnen, die sich ihre Stadt nicht mehr leisten können, kommt zurück. Nun sind zahlungskräftige Käufer nötig, so die Bezirksvorsteherin, die betonte, im 9. Bezirk ist jeder willkommen, auch wenn er reich ist. White gold. Cotton, white gold, as it would come to be known, led to colonialism, the expansion of slavery, the rise of Europe, and the creation of the capitalism system and institutions from which we still operate today. Colonialism is at its root a question of exploiting across geographies. Its roots are in setting up colonies to extract both resources and labor. The roots of how we dress today are also the roots of slavery and colonialism. Systems of oppression that are far from fully dismantled. Just a young.